In this video, we will see how to obtain the direct control of single acting cylinder. So, the electro pneumatic circuit is drawn using the Festo fluid sim software. So, let us draw the circuit first. So, we have to start from the compressor, then we will go to the direction control wall. We will name it as Y1 so that it will be corresponding solenoid wall of the electrical circuit also and then we will connect the ports to the single acting cylinder and then we will see the simulation of the circuit. So let us draw the diagram first. So we will select the compressor. So observe the circuit carefully. Then we will select the 3 by 2 direction control wall, solenoid operated direction control wall. The left envelope mode is solenoid operated and the right envelope mode is spring controlled as shown by this particular spring. So then we will select the single acting cylinder from the components library of the Festo fluid sim software. Give the name as Y1 as we have already seen. So this is the Festo fluid sim software. Hope that you are aware of this particular software. So this has completed our pneumatic circuit. Now we have to draw the electric circuit. So we will choose the power supply elements. Then we will choose the solenoid wall and then the push button switch. So this is the solenoid wall. Give name as Y1. So name must be same. So whatever the name that you give over here Y1, the same must be over here. Connect this. Now select the switch from the components library. So this is known as the push button switch. And then we will complete the circuit. So you can see the various components which we have already discussed are now shown over here. Now run the simulation. So important part, once you press this particular switch, the solenoid, the circuit will be completed. The solenoid wall will get energized and it will operate this solenoid operated direction control wall in such a way that we will get the left envelope mode and the air flow will take place. Compressed air will flow from port 1 to port 2 and then it will cause the piston to move in the forward direction. Once you leave this particular switch, then by default it will come to the right envelope mode. So these are the various specifications of the single acting cylinder. Then you can adjust those specification. Then here these are the specification of the direction control wall. You can adjust the various parameters of the cylinder direction control wall and then you can have the how the working of the simulation can take place with the altered variables also you can see. So in this way we can draw the circuit simple circuit and then simulate it with this particular electrical circuit. So once again see the operation of this circuit so that it will be easy for you to understand. So press the switch so that it will be in the left envelope mode and then once you release it then due to the spring force the retraction of the piston will also take place. So in this way you can use the Festo fluid seam software to draw this pneumatic circuit and the corresponding electrical circuit and that is combined it is known as the electro pneumatic circuit.